Uh, so welcome back guys. My name is Amla and in today's Make Knowledge Free campaign, we try and fix a certain issue. And this is for all iPhone users who have updated to iOS 16. Now, In case some of you have observed that the touch on your iPhone screens have stopped working, well, these are a few troubleshooting steps that you can take. Now, if the touch on the screen has stopped working, it's pretty obvious that you can't touch anything on the screen. So like, you know, suggesting something which goes about pressing or tapping something on the screen really won't work. It's time that you force restart your iPhone. Depending on the iPhone version that you have, you need to perform the steps. I have an iPhone 11. For iPhone 11 or any other advanced iPhone, the way you force restart your phone is you press the volume up, then the volume down, and then you press the side button. Now you do this pretty quickly and you hold on to the side button until the screen blacks out and after a short while you will see the Apple logo. So just hold on to the state until you see the Apple logo and then you can release the side button. The phone will restart or in other words reboot. Once the phone reboots the touch will be set right. But even then I request that you do a following other steps which we'll shortly speak about. So let the phone reboot. Now the phone has rebooted. The steps that I want to talk about is setting touch location to the initial location. And how do you do that? Is by heading towards the settings. Now inside settings, like you scroll down until you see accessibility. So we already are inside accessibility. So you will scroll down until you see accessibility. Inside accessibility, you will head towards touch, tap on touch. Now here, scroll down until you see touch accommodations. Turn this to on and you will see that there's something called as tap assistance. So this is what we are talking about. We want to set it to use initial touch location. If you see a pop-up box which prompts you to press OK, just go ahead and do that. Now, even after doing that, scroll down until you see swipe gestures. Toggle this to on and in the uh, bottom portion where it says required movement, set this to standard. So just go ahead and do this. This will actually ensure that you have a smooth uh, like touch experience even in the future. Now, another thing that you may try doing is that if you have a tampered screen or something, please try taking it off. Please don't use wet or oily hands and take any tampered screens off. If you are on the iOS 16, you may also try downgrading it to iOS 15. If everything fails, you can also do one thing. You can head towards settings, go down until you see general. Here, like you go to transfer or reset phone, tap on reset and you do reset all settings. You will be prompted to enter your passcode and then like it basically works. But I really don't think that this is all necessary. I mean, just the first step of force restarting your phone and then going on to perform the accessibility setting for setting touch to the initial location, that should work wonders. If iOS 16 is still causing an issue, just wait for the new iOS 16 update and that should help the touch issues. If it's still not working and if it's hardware related, you may want to take it to Apple store and they will fix it for you guys. Well, somebody has also suggested that if you can tap the phone like this and then massage the phone, something like this, and then do the force restart, that is like the volume up, then the volume down and then the side button all too quickly so that you can see the black screen and then the Apple logo and then wait for the phone to restart. Well, I mean, this also helps and I mean your phone once it reboots, the touch is set perfectly. Well, all the steps, I think your phone is now ready to go and you will not have the touch issue bothering you again. If you think that today's tutorial helps you and if your touch issue is fixed, especially after you had the iOS 16 update, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and please do share this with your friends and family because somebody out there may be concerned about this and they really may not be knowing what to do. And please do subscribe and tap on the bell icon for notifications and do let me know in the comment section on how you found this video. So that's all from my side guys. Until next time, it's me Amlan signing off.